Vice President Sara Duterte says she was used by the Marcoses in the 2022 elections to secure their win against former Vice President Lenny Robredo. According to Duterte, it was in October 2021 when she received a call from Senator Amy Marcos asking her to vie for Vice Presidency with her brother, now President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. as her running mate. Pagdating ng late October after deadline ng filing, tumawad sa akin si Senator Amy Marcos. Sabi niya sa akin, pwede ka ba tumakbong vice president? Sabi ko sa kanya, alam mo, hindi ko pa narinig ever na sinabi sa akin na tumakbo akong vice president. Sabi ko, bakit mo ako nire-request ngayon na tumakbong vice president? And... I'm happy that she was honest enough to say kasi matatalo kami ni Lenny kung hindi mo dalahin ang Bisaya. It was very straightforward. Asked if this meant she was used, Duterte responds in the affirmative. So, hmm, ano yung isang tanong? Nagamit. Yes. Clear naman yun. Tinanong ko, bakit ako? And then she said, matatalo kami ni Lenny kung hindi di, di mo dalihon ang mga bisaya. However, Duterte said that she was never forced to run, explaining that her decision to run for vice president was very rational. According to Duterte, she does not regret being Bongbong's running mate, adding that she was sure God had a reason for assigning her to the post. She also explained that running for vice president allowed her to escape the scrutiny of politicians who were already gauging prospective candidates in the 2028 elections.